As times evolved, people's um, willingness to try new varieties has changed. We're now there's all sorts of different varieties growing and people are really willing to try something different out of the, you know, the essential norm. The region is adapting and going through a massive transition period. Winemakers have been well travelled, we've gone and seen and made wine elsewhere and identified from regions with similar climates but what varieties work best and then to bring them home and grow them here and then produce those styles and expressions from this region is, is what I get, essentially we were doing. We're looking for things that suit our climate, not, not necessarily things that no one's ever heard of, but certainly things that aren't traditionally grown in the Swan Valley and Vermentino and Drift are two great examples of where it's worked. Um, so further to that, um, we're looking at things like Montepulciano, um, maybe Chiriga. So we, yeah, we try to piggyback off varieties that grow well in similar climates and then, and then it, it should give us a good chance of, of doing good things. I think um, it's working in well with um, both needing to do something um, viticulturally and look at different varieties for the area and also people are um, accepting um, you know, wine in a different way. And there's no rules anymore and I think that's a good thing.